What do you think? I wanted to thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule, Mr. Luther. I understand how time-consuming making license plates can be. You're not gonna touch me with that rock in your hand. You won't get near me, not with my speed. You're never gonna get away with this. Oh, but I am. With my mind and your body, the sky's the limit, Clark. I don't know what you're talking about. You know, it's becoming clear to me why you're so secretive. You understand that true power is better left concealed. No matter how hard you try, you'll never be me. My parents, my friends, they'll see right through you. I'm not so sure. They haven't so far, have they? I need you to do something for me. Say the name Mian and these numbers. Why? Because if you don't, your good friend Lex will very shortly be dead. An unfortunate accident. But he's your son, your only child. And I'm his only father. That didn't stop him from putting me in prison and robbing me of everything I had. Now speak the words into the recorder, or you will be directly responsible for your friend's death. Turns out he, uh, uh, transference is um, eventually going to come to an end. You will revert back to your original bodies eventually. When? I suppose it could happen at any time. Yeah, I thought you'd want to know that. <laughs> there must be some way to make it permanent. Well, none that I see, uh, save murder. <laughs> and theoretically speaking, if you were to, you know, kill the other you, then there would be no you for you to revert back to. So, you know, I suppose you could be Clark Kent for the rest of your life. Big plan for this Clark Kent. 